Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to tell you guys about some really important details when it comes to your menstrual cycle. So I wanted to show you guys today some of my favorite natural brand pads and tampons. Um, I don't use tampons anymore, so it'd be mo mainly pads, but these brands that I'm going to name are going to be for both pads and tampons. They both, they sell them both. So I wanted to tell you guys about that today. Okay, let me first start by saying for those of you who are completely new um, to like using all natural brands and you just don't see the purpose of it. When it comes to pads and tampons, a lot of people do not realize this because it's not on the packaging, but a lot of tampons have coloring on them, they have chlorine on them, they have so much things that they put onto the pads. Technically, they don't have to tell you what you um, are using with your pads. And this is because it's a kind of like a health um, related type of thing. So they feel as though if they tell you what's in your pads and you see it and you, um, you say like, oh no, I can't use that. You would essentially be like, not taking care of your needs. So they see it as a point of where they don't have to put what is in their tampons or pads on the packaging. Now, a lot of people say, oh, you wanna use it for a week. Well, we as women get our periods for monthly, so you're not only using it like for a week, you're using it all throughout the year. So it is very important to make sure that you are keeping that area pretty like right and tight because that's where life comes in that's where you're bringing in life that's where a lot of things are happening and it's also a very essential part to women's health when it comes to like brands that have been around for like literally decades those brands have not taken the responsibility to say you know people have to put this on their body we're not going to you know do the pads this way we're going to do it this way and they haven't taken a natural route. I'm now starting to see more companies realize that people are not wanting to use chemicals anymore. They're wanting to be a lot more healthier. I'm gonna name a couple brands in this video and tell you my thoughts on them. So let's go ahead and start with one of my favorites, which is the Rao. I don't know if I'm saying that right. This is what it looks like. It's the Rio Rao. And they are organic cotton cover pads. So of course, these are the disposable ones. I've tried the reusable ones and I wasn't a huge fan of, of them. So I won't be naming those the reusable ones in this video. But let's just start with this brand here. So this is one of my favorite brands. So this company does have organic tampons and pads. So all their products that they come out with are organic. I love that first of all. Second of all, they use um, they tell you what they're using in their product on the back of the packaging, which is new because normally they don't tell you what they're using. They just give you your pads and you go on about your day. But on here it says that they use 100% um, organic cotton top sheets. So that means the top of the sheet is organic. That's the part that's touching your um, private area. It also tells you that they do not use toxic adhesive. So if you have sensitive skin, they also tell you that it is chlorine free and fragrance free, which is super important because um, for me personally, I cannot have fragrance down there and I cannot be like out in these streets, like just doing whatever I want. So I do have sensitive skin. So that was really big for me when I seen that was fragrance free. And also they don't put chlorine on it. So you remember I told you guys that they put all types of stuff like chlorine on pads and things like that. They're just letting you know on this brand, they do not do that. So this was one of the brands that I actually like because it is super absorbent and it does not feel as though you're sac sacrificing quality just so that you are able to use like a healthier pad because there is some natural brands where you feel like that you're sacrificing a lot of quality just so that you can use like nice pads because they're super thin or they don't absorb the way that they're supposed to. So absolutely um, recommend this one. So this next one I'm gonna name, I do not have here with me of course, but I'm going to put it right here and this is the Nature Care, Natural Care um, brand. I do not know if I'm saying these names right, but like I said, I'll have it here on the screen. When I tell you that this is like one of my favorites, I, it's the first one that I started to use. It was one of the first ones that were on the market in my, from what I know, I haven't seen anything. Back when I was getting like organic 
pads. I didn't see anything else besides this one. So when it comes to this brand here, they do make sure that they're giving you great quality when it comes to the way that it absorbs. Also, when it actually comes to the way that they make the pads. So this company and the company that I named in the first clip are definitely the ones that I like always get. Um, the Rao brand, I will say, is a little bit more seclusive to target so it's a little bit harder to find whereas i'm always in like um whole foods they do have it at whole foods this brand here and i do see them also in kroger now so they're starting to be more like out in like mainstream um stores and stuff like that so they're more readily available so this brand is called the seventh generation and they are more widely known they are at more stores like kroger they do have them at also Target, they do have them at Whole Foods and health food stores. So they carry like all types of things when it comes to disc detergent and things like that. So I've used them all throughout um, my house. So I do like this brand just because it is very absorbent and you absolutely do not feel like that you're sacrificing quality um, just so that you can have like a healthier brand. So when it comes to this brand, I have been using this as well for years. So this brand Cora, I've just recently tried this out. I got this out of Target. Um, and these are organic pads as well. And this was the overnight brand that I actually got. So when it comes to this brand, I felt like that the packaging was really good. So it really did grab my attention. It does look like it is completely clean. So it did grab my attention. So on the back, it also tells you what's in it. So it says that it's transparent with the ingredients that's on it and it actually tells you what they mostly put in here. I don't think it goes into detail as far as like every single thing is in here, but it does tell you most of it, uh, most of the things are in here. So it does tell you that they do not put any type of chlorines, fragrances, no, um, no type of chemicals, no latex, um, nothing that is going polyester, nothing that's going to irritate down there. They promise that. And then they also tell you that they use organic cotton it is plant-based so that means that they do not use anything that is from an animal we all know that and it also is super absorbent is what they say and it also has leak proof back sheet so they tell you that and they kind of just say that like they're trying to be as transparent as, pro as possible and tell you what they do with the material on the pads also it says that it's leak proof and that you don't have to worry about it going through or anything like this. Okay, let me give you my opinion on this. I use these and I was not impressed. So the reason why I wasn't impressed is because they were too thin. If this brand would come out with some, with some pads that would be like a lot more absorbent and a lot thicker, I would go back to using this. So I'm not saying that this was a completely um, bad brand um, or maybe I just need to get Oh, I got overnight, so I don't think... Well, there's one... Okay, I could get one up, so I'm guessing I got the one that was second to big to the most absorbent. But even with the overnight, they were super thin, and I don't know, I just didn't... I wouldn't get this all the time. And I would buy this again, but I just wouldn't... It just wouldn't be my number one thing. It would just have to be where, you know, maybe the stores didn't have all of the pads that I needed and I just wanted to grab this one or something like that. Okay, so I wanted to talk to you guys about the L brand because remember, and if you had watched my older video where I talked about the hygiene products that I use, which if you guys wanna see another hygiene um, product video, comment down below because a lot of you like that video. These are exclusively in Target. I've never seen them anywhere else. Um, so these are called the L, that's it, just the L pads. And they're chlorine free, ultra thin pads. Now the thing about these that I love is that these were the kind of like the first ones that I seen in my area that appeared as like the natural brand and target um the thing i like about these is these give you a lot of pads so you have 42 pads and you only pay like 6.99 for them so they do not use any type of pesticides no. i of course got the super so this is what it looks like so it says it's made by women for women so that was a another thing that grabbed my attention um on the back it does not really tell you what's in the pads, but it does tell you what type of materials they use Oh, so these are organic cotton. Why aren't they advertising that on the front? 
huh and these are cruelty free and yeah so this i would recommend if you don't want to spend and splurge on some pads and you just want to get the same price range that you would get if you were getting regular pads so these are readily available in target and you don't have to go searching to all over the place because they're literally going to be in your target i have been through different states and everything and had my period and had to go get pads and these are always there okay guys so those were my top pads that i recommend when it comes to natural pads now there are other ways that you can you know avoid using chemicals when it comes to your menstrual cycle you can use those i've never used them so i can't really give you my opinion on them but i have heard women say that they have suffered from no cramps since using those and that their period is just a lot better to deal with also reusable pads that's another option that can be definitely used now like i said i wasn't a big fan of reusable reusable pads because i felt as though it was way too much moisture and I just didn't like the fact that I had to keep washing, you know, my pads. It just felt kind of weird to me. What is another one? I think those are all of the things that you can do as far as being more eco-friendly, better to yourself, um, better to your body. I don't know if there's any other like methods that can be used, but if you guys know any, then definitely leave them down in the comment section. Like I said, guys, when it comes to your menstrual cycle, there's a lot of things that can be overlooked. There's a lot of a lot of things that can be put on the back burner and people just be like, oh, it's nothing, you know, it's just, just your, <laughs> your period and you don't have to worry about it. When in reality, you do. That is a very important part of your health and of your body. And you want to make sure that you're treating yourself well and you're treating that area down there well because if that area goes to you know goes out of whack then everything else is going to be out of whack trust me so make sure you are gentle down there and if you are not aware then i will have some information linked down in the description box and also some links for you guys so that you can kind of like research more information about this um, i've talked about this so many times on my channel um and it's just an important topic that i feel needs to be refreshed every now and then all right guys so if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up i'm gonna have video linked up here of when i went more into depth of my hygiene routine and if you guys want to see an updated one like i said thumbs up this video or comment down below and i will see you guys in my next one stay safe and yeah i'll see you guys soon bye